Right guys, Gaft is back with the explanation to the stacked deck guaranteed bar bet card trick you saw yesterday. It is a stacked deck, but the stack is very simple. It just goes red, black, red, black, red, black, or black, red, black, red, black, red, whichever way you want to put it around. But it's just red and black, and that is the stack. I've no idea how this principle really works, but it seems to work every time. So once you've got your deck stacked, you can go up to your spectator and sh show them that the deck is all mixed up. Now you're best not just spreading through like this because they'll probably notice it goes red, black, red, black, red, black, or black, red, whatever. But if you just take off bunches of cards and show them they're all mixed up. What you do need to do is cut the deck roughly in half. It doesn't matter if it's not in half, but you do need to cut, let's say this is a black card, you need to cut a red card. So you could just spread through the cards, find a red card, cut the deck at that point, and then give them a shuffle. Spectator can riffle shuffle them if they want, but if you think your spectator can't riffle shuffle, they've just seen a pretty much a random mixed up deck and you're going to give it a quick riffle shuffle to mix it up some more. You're now going to spread the cards and show them that the cards are all mixed up. And all you're going to do is look for two cards of the same colour. I can see I've got two black cards here. So you're just going to scoop the pack up and split it at that point where the cards are the same colour and place the cards down. Spectator now has a free choice to pick either packet. It makes no difference whatsoever. Let's say they pick this packet. We're going to place this packet on top of this packet and then get them to deal cards now it doesn't matter how many cards they deal, but because what you're going to do is ask them to guess what colour the card is, you want a few cards. So I think 10 is a good number, so we deal 10 cards. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So you've got two packets of cards now, and once again your spectator has got a completely free choice to pick whichever packet they want. Let's say they pick this packet, we'll put this one aside. They are just going to guess what colour these cards are. Let's say they think it's a red card. And it is a red card. Now if you get it wrong, I'll up jog it. What colour is this? A red? And it's a black, so you got that wrong, we'll up jog it. Uh, another red? It is a red. Black? It is a black. Black? Oh, it's a red. Red? Oh, it is a red. Um, black? No, it's a red. Black, it is a black. Uh, red, no it's a black so that's wrong. And once again red, and it is a red card. So your spectator has got a 50% hit rate. Completely guessing what colour the cards are. Now you pick up your packet and your cards. Now this is why I don't understand how this works. If this card is a red card, your first card will be a black card. So you're just going to look at the colours of these cards. I'll push this up a bit. And if this is a red card, then this is a black card. This next card was a black card, so this one is going to be a red card. We've got a red, so this is a black. We've got a black, so this is a red. We've got a red, this is a black. We've got another black, because that's a red. We've got another black, another black, because that's a red. We've got a red card because this one's black. We've got another red card. And finally we have, this is red, this is the opposite, it's a black card. So that's how the trick works guys. I've got no idea how that works, but it seems to work every time. So if you could not follow that tutorial, just rewind the video, watch it again. It's very simple. You just need to start out with black and red or red and black. When you cut the cards, you, at the beginning you'll cut at a red card, because this is a black card. You will then shuffle the cards together. You will show the cards to be all mixed up. And you will just find two cards of the same colour. I've got a jack and a ten here, so I'm going to scoop up to the jack to make two roughly equal piles. Your spectator's got a free choice to put either pile on top of whatever and then deal the cards onto the table. Now this is not going to work again because this is all messed up, this stack 
but yeah it's that simple so make sure to smash the like button guys subscribe to the gaft academy post notifications on and we'll see you tomorrow for another card trick cheers